2022 and I'm at Vancouver Community College VCC, the auditorium. And tonight, uh, once again, I've been asked by John Korsrud to come out and film one of his events. Tonight he's got a new project, part of his Mixophonics series. So I'm going to let him tell you more about it. Mixophonics was a uh, uh, two-year series we had at Atlanta Luz in the downtown east side and uh, near, really close to Oppenheimer Park. And we just basically an evening of improv of kind of like psychedelic grooves and noise and, and uh, abstract sound. It was a very, very popular series we did for two years until COVID. Uh, shut us down. And this is kind of like an extension of the Mix Mixophonics Festival, what, what we learned from those concerts and events, taking the next step and bringing them here. It's called Sound Palace. This is the first concert of six. This is a very contemporary form of new music. It's not academic, it's, it's exploratory, it's new, it's fresh. It doesn't have roots in like 1950s classical new music and all that sort of stuff. It's, it has roots in pop music and improvisation and noise and all that sort of stuff. As long as you have good musicians, you have good music. We have guest curators at every concert. Kimmy is our first curator. I'm the first guest curator of the Sound Palace concert series. There is going to be visual artists, harp player, accordion, percussion, electronics. We have projections, which makes it very fun for the audience. If they're open to receiving what's going on there, they'll, they'll get all kinds of crazy ideas that are being expressed by all the different musicians, and they'll hear how those ideas interact and play with each other. Yes, it's for the audience, but it's a lot for us to enjoy playing together. Creativity is at play here. There we're going to jam together, we're going to improvise. You've got electronics playing with uh, acoustic instruments. You've got an open communication that's happening. We're going to listen together, react to it together. You're also improvising, so it's a conversation that's occurring. And so through that conversation, you discover new connections and new ways of um, coexistence. And that's what we need in this world. Like tonight's show is going to feature uh, not just the musicians themselves, but a whole VJ set. There's going to be uh, visuals and a general jam session, audio visual experience. Yeah, sometimes I miss VJing. Sometimes I miss getting into the groove with the rest of the group, playing along and doing visual accompaniment, feed off the music and work that into the video work that I do. I don't get a lot of chance to do that doing videography. Usually I'm just holding a camera. It's not like I can bounce along with the music with a camera, otherwise the audience is gonna get motion sick. But at the end of the day, I guess I do more documentary stuff and it's best that I document a lot of the stuff so you can see it, so you folks at home can actually see all the hard work that a lot of the creative people in Vancouver do for you. Yeah, it's a good group of people, looks like tonight. Uh, a lot of creative people doing a lot of creative things. And uh, that's what it's all about. That's why I do these videos, is to show the world there are creative people doing creative stuff. Playfulness is a rare thing in this world right now. It's a very crazy, tough world. And these get-togethers, these improvisations, these uh, situations like this encourage playfulness. And I think that's something we need.